Hello and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing a game called Meat Shift. It's the early 20th century and I am going to be attending a slaughterhouse to see if I can maybe make some sausages. If you want to do that for yourselves, look down below in the description. You can find the links and the details down there, alright? Now, hope you enjoy it. Let's play. Or rather, let's walk towards a grinder. Uh... Am I playing as a pig? <laughs> I didn't think I was, to be honest. I'm gonna make myself into sausages. Uh, oh no. Okay. Maybe we're just sort of going back and forth in perspectives. Right. What wonderful snow. Weird kind of look for the game with this filter. It's kind of sort of dour and drab and dreary and... I don't know. In other words, the begin with D to continue the alliteration. Oh! Okay, what we got here? We're gonna clock in. Of course we are. Okay. So ah, right. So I've clocked in. So let's start our shift. Yeah, let's get to work. All right. Now I can't play this without thinking back to a game I previously played called Pigsaw. Maybe this is revenge of sorts. You know. Nothing in the cupboard by the looks of it. So let's just close that up. We've got a, a wax cylinder. Alright. Nice sausage fingers you've got there. Open. Wow, I've got really, really long arms. <laughs> Nothing in there? Something in the box? No. Nope. These ones. Okay. What we got? What's in this cupboard? Anything? Oh, oh this is where I put the cylinder. Right. Oh. So that's a recording. Okay. Listen for the work siren. Okay. Vital and tremendously important work. Okay. I should remember that. Oh, there you go. There's the siren. So, are we going back? Or Oh, no, no. Okay, we're going to the meat rooms. Alright. So, I, I take it this is kind of like my first day on the job. I don't really know what I'm doing. Okay, Mrs. Verbeck. She's going to be in charge of the stockyard. There she is. Hey there. There you go, there's the pigs. Uh, let's wave. Hi. Interesting style. Alright. Right. Sorry, little buddies, but uh, I'm going to enjoy eating you, I think. Right. There you go. Some <laughs> sample sausages. That's what we're aiming for today, I think. Your first task will be the splitting of pig bellies. Lovely. In here? Okay, yep, yeah, this is the belly splitting room. Okay. Oh, look at this. Oh, the, the knife, the cleaver. Okay, I got my equipment. Mechanism that will flush the trowels, ridding them of any blood and entrails that once been drained into them. Okay. Well, there's a big old valve over here, so maybe this is what you're talking about? Okay. Ah, right, that's it. Okay, well, I've got the butcher knife. I'm going to slip them top to bottom and void them of their insides. When they arrive. Is this okay? This is where I, <laughs> this is where I call them. Oh, here we are. Contestant one, two, and three here. Ah, uh, split the pig. Okay. Not a terribly pleasant thing to do, but uh, I sure do love bacon. Okay. So that's all I need to do at this part of the process, it seems. I, I don't take their insides out. Maybe I have to split them all, and then we do that. Okay. How am I doing so far? Good. Oh, well. I guess that's that. And off they go. So is somebody else going to cut them into chunks, into sections, or am I going to have to do that? 
I've put away the butcher knife. I guess we're done. You know, I was expecting this place to be busier. <laughs> okay. Alright, so what's the next room? This one here? Right. The conveyor belt and the grinder. That's what I'm going to find in here. Alright, lovely. The meat containment vat. Yeah. Okay, it's only the highest quality, apparently. But I'm sure they'd all say that, wouldn't they? Well, there you go. There's the conveyor belt. Let's see. Yeah, seriously. We need, we need more lights in here. Or Oh, who's this? Someone up there? Was that a, a flashback of what I was doing? Was that me? <laughs> oh, here we go. Here's the vat. Oh, lovely. So, collect the meat. Put it on the belt. And off it goes to uh, get grinded up. Oh, jeez! That was a lot louder than I was expecting. Wow, okay. Okay, let's do it for the rest of them. There you go. Let's keep this process going. Was that it? Just those three pieces? Right. Oh boy, alright. Yeah, that's, that's gone in. And that's good. Okay, uh, I, I guess we're done. We're moving on to the next part of the process now. Wow, yeah. That was, that was violently loud. I suppose that's the point. That's probably what they were trying to get across. So, I'm actually pretty sure that this game was made in seven days for a, a game jam of sorts. So far, so good. Okay. Oh, it's time for my break! Oh, really? Oh, well, thank you very much! The Sprat brand canned sausages. Right. It is so good that you must come to it sooner or later. Alright, here we are again. A can from the shelf. Over here. Retrieve utensils with which to eat. <laughs> Sounds so very alien. Right, put the, put the can on the table. That's it, okay. Uh, so we need to find some utensils. Oh, oh, take a plate, that'll do. Open the can. And eat a sausage. That was a short break. Are you kidding? Right, to the meat rooms. Uh, so is, okay, it's just gonna go back through this again, isn't it? Right. So we just rinse and repeat. We just keep on doing this again and again, do we? Oh, there she is. Uh, what was her name? Mrs. Ver something? Oh, well, got less pigs. That makes sense. No waving? No? Okay. Right. It is... I, I was trying to wave! I was trying to be polite! Oh, there you go. There's the prompt. Hey. And she gives me a wave back. Right. Uh, send some more my way. I'll deal with them, I suppose. So, yeah, through here again. So, let's just go split those bellies. Is is that me? I can't really see. Is that maybe that was the view of someone down there, or is it like the pig going through there? Well, there's is that is that blood down there? Huh. Okay, but yeah, okay, so let's start that machine, let's flush this, and, yep, they insist we split the bellies. Okay, so, let's call them in. Mm-hmm, okay. Let's start with you. Alright. Two more to go, and then I suppose we'll be putting you guys in the conveyor. Oh. Oh, ma oh, lovely. Maggots. Fuck. Can I do something with this one? Oh, that's ridiculous. Ugh, and I ate one of the sausages as well. Oh, no. Yeah. What were you talking about, them being the finest fucking quality? That one isn't. What? 
But, okay. Let's hope somebody checks that. Alright, again, we're done. Let's go to the conveyor belt, I suppose. Alright. Yeah, I, I, I hope we don't see any maggots in this room. They've been dealt with in some way. We demand you feed the grinder. You demand now? You're insisting before. Okay, so pull the lever. Get it started. Okay. Looks like there's some more down there. Yep. Mmm, I see the maggots there. No. Okay. Alright, that seems okay. Uh-huh, alright. Yeah, there's, there's probably a couple of maggots on this, but fuck. Oops. It got me again! Ah, oh, shit. That is not good. But we're done! We're done. So does that mean I get another really short break in the break room? I guess so, right? We just have to keep going through the loop. This is quite PT-esque. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. Yep. Alright. Okay, back to the break room. I, I don't think I fancy another sausage. Don't know about you guys, but yeah, I, I, it kind of turned me off them a little bit. Oh no. Oh, fuck, they're wriggling by themselves. I'm glad there isn't a prompt to eat one. Uh, oh, it's just... <laughs> I thought there was then. It's just to close that up. Oh yeah, let's uh, let's continue making these horrendous sausages. Right. So, uh, we must be whittling the pigs down, right? Oh, where's uh, Mrs. Verbeck? I can still wave, apparently. I don't see her, but just in case. I don't think she's there, but neither are the pigs, so... How's this gonna work? <laughs> what am I gonna be splitting? Uh, that is me, isn't it? This is getting quite eerie now, actually. Yeah. Who was that? Mrs. Verbeck? Hmm, okay, well let's just go through the process. Let's go through the procedure and see what happens. I don't think we'll have too much to do this time. Okay. The butcher's knife's gone. Okay, well, uh, we've got to flush this out, right? We've got to clear that out. With blood, this time. Alright. Well, let's see what we get. Not a great deal by the looks of it. Huh. Well, um, let's move on to the next part, I suppose. Because <laughs> I think I'm done here. It feels like I'm being followed. Just that one little scene that lasted, what, like two or three seconds? It's kind of put me on edge now. Anyway. Do we have anything to put in? It looks empty from up here. Maybe there's, I don't know, scraps? I can still get this started. Oh. Well. I can get it broken. Oh, what's that? There's a, there's a valve or something. Is that like a... Oh, was that a hatch? Yeah, open the door. Am I gonna... Oh, there's like a trotter in there. Is this safe? This doesn't seem safe. Oh, gee! Oh, right. Okay. What did I say? It doesn't seem safe. Now he's got a, a couple less sausages. He's been barefoot the entire time? What the hell? You have failed to follow protocol. Mrs. Furbeck has been notified. Okay. Is she going to give me a, a telling off? 
Uh, <laughs> is that her? What the fuck? Okay, I I think I'm gonna find other employment, honestly. This isn't really working out for me. What the fuck is that? Right. Yeah, this way. She's still coming? Yep, she's still coming. It's like a smoke monster wearing an apron or something. Right. We found a dead end. What the fuck? Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, I got my fingers back. I think. Wait, that... Hmm. Maybe I'm someone else? Oh. Oh! That's me looking up at previous me. Yes! Right, so we're getting the other perspective now. So there was someone down here? Right. Shall I? Go on. Oh boy. Oh man, this is so dark! Oh, there is a light there. I'm just gonna go towards the light. Okay, right, yeah. I don't know if you'll be able to see anything. Yeah, he's, he was like waving up at us. We didn't notice. We didn't see that. Are we gonna see... Are we gonna see him lose his fingers? Jesus. So hard to see anything here. Is there oh! oh! Including a fucking hole in the floor, apparently. Oh, there we are, back at the grinder. Right! So I wasn't playing as a pig at the beginning. It's a man. Long pig, is it? Right, so that's where it ends. Okay, so don't get your fingers caught in the machinery. You don't want to end up down there. That is not a fate that you want to meet. Uh, I suppose that's why the factory was so scarce of people, because they all went down there through the grinder. Oh boy. So yeah, that was Meat Shift. Uh, and that was alright. For a game made in seven days or so as well, that was, uh, that was actually pretty good. It was quite unique. Quite morbid with the subject matter, gutting animals and such, going through a slaughterhouse. Um, kind of creepy, kind of eerie, especially when Mrs. Verbeck disappeared and turned into something else when she was chasing me down. But still wearing the apron, yeah. <laughs> still wearing her uniform in a strange way. But uh, yeah, that was my first and my last shift at that slaughterhouse. And thank you for joining me. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. I'm gonna make myself into sausages. Uh, oh no. Nice sausage fingers you've got there. Open? Wow, I've got really, really long arms. There you go. Some <laughs> sample sausages. That's what we're aiming for today, I think. Oh, jeez! That was a lot louder than I was expecting. Retrieve utensils with which to eat. <laughs> it sounds so very alien. No waving? No? Okay. Right. It is... I, I was trying to wave! I was trying to be polite! Oh. Oh, ma oh! We demand you feed the grinder. You demand now? You're insisting before! Alright, yeah, there's, there's probably a couple of maggots on this, but fuck it. It got me again! It kind of turned me off them a little bit. Oh no. Oh, fuck, they're wriggling by themselves. That is me, isn't it? Oh, oh! Is she going to give me a, a telling off? Uh, <laughs> is that her? What the fuck? Okay, I I think I'm going to find other employment, honestly. So hard to see anything here. Is there, oh, oh! Including a fucking hole in the floor, apparently. <laughs>